that's that's fantastic. <laughs> Speaking of which, Ramsey, now you were talking about the fact that figuring was that change, that kind of difference that you were looking for. I was watching seventy six, mm -hmm. and you know what came to mind? Mm -hmm. Nicolas Cage in Face Off. Now, for real? Yes, and <laughs> I need to ask: Is and well, maybe you can answer. Maybe is there a dark side to you? That's me, like... You know, the truth about it is, like, in virtually everybody, there's a dark side. So, yeah. I mean, no, no, there's no need to be hypocritical about it. Yeah. There's no need to deny it. Mm. In every every human, there's a dark side. Yeah. It depends on how dark. Yeah. I would not deny that I don't have a dark side. We okay. all do. So, yeah. Because but, yeah, the way I'm not going to like... share that, though. Oh, okay. <laughs> because the way you, like... If, anyway, I'm, like I'm saying, you have watched Figurine, you have watched 76, the way you switch... Mm -hmm. As in, I watched 76, I had... Goosebumps, as in mm. it felt like the way Nicolas Cage switched from his yeah. bad self to yeah. his good self, yeah. even trying to maintain that good, yeah, bad yeah. aura was a bit tough for him. But yeah. it feels like you give out an icy stare, mm -hmm. you do know, right? Yeah. Like, <laughs> like people see you, I'm like, oh my god, he just changed though. How does that <laughs> happen? How you can learn that, obviously, or how, how do you interpret that when you want to like. You know you are, you are good at one point, but you have to go bad within the same space. Uh, characterization, which you develop over time. Mm. You know, you. I sometimes watch a whole lot of people. You know, okay. I read about performance, actings, and all of that. Mm. A whole lot of mannerisms and gender, you know, um, uh, gestures, behavioral pattern. You know, mm. so many things that you have to, you know, tend to um, adopt as you grow as an actor. You mm. know. I mean, there are different kinds of bad boys. Yeah. There are different kinds of bados. And yeah. there are different kinds of goodies. <laughs> I agree. You know, there is the Mrs. Doubtfire kind of goodie. Yeah. And then there's the, um, um, what was the other guy? Two goodie twos or whatever. You know, we all have them. And yeah. you have the bad side too. Mm. So you have the, you have the, uh, how do I call it now? Al Pacino bad in uh, yeah. Scarface. You have the Daniel Craig you, bad and good. Thank you. Mm. Exactly. So, we have all of that now it all depends on the one that you use the most and can mm. get the best of mm -hmm. you, you know depending on the director the director looks at you and then sees that side that part that dark side that he thinks that yeah that will deliver the character he wants you know the yeah. most then he tries to pick it up from you mm -hmm. as you deliver so those things are not what you uh i wouldn't say they're me i wouldn't say yeah. basically i'm fighting you and i'm Staring icily at you now in real life. That's <laughs> okay. In real life, I'll probably carry stick or something. <laughs> and deal with you properly. Yes, kind of thing. Okay. So, I, I mentioned The Vow. Mm -hmm. And the reason why I mentioned The Vow, which is a very old movie, was mm -hmm. because, as in, I had a friend that we loved the soundtrack. So, it was a very crazy soundtrack. You Remember? Me we made it. It was that kind of, <laughs> I did watch movies <laughs> back in the day, but... Oh my God. Maybe I'm putting you on the spot though, That's but fine. which will be who will be your like your best actress that you know gets you once both of you the on screen chemistry is right on and you people are like you know what we bounce off each other, bounce off each other. and yeah. you know I There's don't even need to vibe. work yeah I don't need to work too hard when I'm with this person who will that person um, be? Um, it's almost really hard to tell exactly who's um, who I think I have more chemistry with than okay. the other. Mm -hmm. I am very fluid. I, I tend to carry a lot of people along with me rather than me, you know, looking for that flow with the other person. Okay. I carry a lot of people along. Okay. I, I take them into my realm. They take me. So it's more about me taking you along than me. So basically, I've realized that I can actually work very well with virtually everybody. Everyone. Except, oh, okay. of course, <laughs> naturally, as an actress, you don't have it in you. Okay. Except you do not have it in you at all. Then, of course, I can't find it. Okay. But definitely, if you do, mm -hmm. you know, I will flow into your realm. I will yes. bring you into mine. Yeah. And that's how I. That's how I relate. So it's pretty hard to so pick. A uh, there is a particular <laughs> character, you know, not exactly. I'm okay. thinking also story-wise, mm. character-wise, determine um, chemistries. Do you care what I'm saying? Yeah. A whole lot of people do think that chemistry is between you and this other actor or this other actress yeah. is based on. Um, the fact that naturally you both have something. Yeah. No, it probably it's probably the character she's playing or okay. the character you're playing. Yeah. I give her a different character and you find out probably the chemistry is not working. It's not the same. Yeah. yeah. You know, I get it, you. It, it, it has its ways it, the ways it works. Yeah, I get you. So Ramsey's still in the studio as in this is an eye opener which it was like a one hour. 
<laughs> program. I'm sorry because I would like to hear more. <laughs> but oh. you can call. You can call him. Oh, we missed that call. But you can call. <laughs> I'm still laughing. I'm chuckling. Hello, <laughs> caller. Good evening. What's your name and where are you calling from? Hello. Good Hi. Good evening. Okay. Do we have some men out there that would like to ask around the questions? Okay. Well, what's, old already. <laughs> <laughs> what's your name and where are you calling from? Ah. Okay. Okay. Oh, Welcome. Thank you. Happy New Year. Okay. I always get that all the time, man. It's like, it's like you need to make me feel like I'm a grandfather. Uh, me? <laughs> oh, wow. It's nice. Sweet of you. Very sweet. Thank you. Okay, she was. Oh, do you have any. Sorry? I have a question. Ah, okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, and that's what I said I respect before. Like, there's so much scandal in the industry, but I've never heard, like, yeah. Yes. Never heard any scandal about me. Or maybe she's not searching. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, you know what? Just look at me like a cat. Mm. We poo and you never see our poops. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Something like that. Yeah. No, naturally, I'm not scandalous by nature. I'm a very easy going guy. That's why I said I'm a lover. I'm a lover boy. <laughs> because I was going to ask, how do you handle the fame aspect of it and then the downfall so as in everybody said they've known you since they were young mm -hmm. anybody in fact even coming in they were like i've always wanted to be like you i had some bassa who said he watched him i think it was silent night he actually watched for him to even start acting really yes he said so so <laughs> but yes there's the fame and then obviously there are the downfalls how do mm -hmm. you basically handle that um, of, of all my years in the industry, I've been mm. able to find a balance. Because uh, yeah. in life, generally, as you move on, you need to find the equilibrium. You know, mm. you have to find that balance that sustains you yeah. one way or the other. I mean, mm. there's an overwhelming love, mm -hmm. you know, and people who care, people who want to show you that they appreciate you. Yeah. So much, you know, and some of them saying it's so overwhelming that they can be like consumed. Yeah, everybody totally is like Ramsey. I know. But, <laughs> however, you know, you need to now find that way you can actually. Mm. It's, it's pretty. It's not easy. I must be very honest yeah. with you. It's hard to please everybody. Mm -hmm. It's really hard. Yeah. You're trying to please um, all the fans. Everybody mm. wants your attention. Everybody wants to get, you know, a piece of you. And mm -hmm. likewise, your family. Mm -hmm. Likewise, your kids, your children, you know, likewise, your mother. Yeah. Likewise, your brothers, likewise, <laughs> your friends. People who've yeah. known you from time. It's a whole lot. It's a lease. It's, on, it's endless. Okay. And you're thinking, how do I balance it out? At some mm. point, you just minister, you you try to talk to those people who are closer to you. That, Please, I beg of you, just try and understand. understand that this I'm is... only human, yeah. I beg. There's a, there's a limit I can go, you know. Yeah. You don't wreck me in this process of just <laughs> showing so me love. Any, no, well, this will be like a normal question. People have basically jumped on you when they see you. Like, oh, Ropsy! Yeah, okay, well, okay, that would always that. happen, yeah. <laughs> okay, but quick one before we wrap it up. Yeah. How do you take criticism that comes from maybe a role you've played so if someone comes and said well it has to be objective anyway but yeah. someone that like oh Ramsey shouldn't have done this kind of role mm -hmm. or Ramsey didn't put in his all in this kind of role mm -hmm. how do you handle criticism that comes it um, most times when it's um, constructively you know um, pitched or said it's mm. okay i mean I'm, I'm i'm fine by it yeah certain people are uh, just very negative minded and they just want to throw it out the way they feel it you know rather than yeah. you know most times people so are selfish they, they say things from their own perspective not thinking mm. about the other person okay. which sometimes we find a bit um a bit like a slap on the face sometimes the way yeah. it comes well if i get a constructive criticism about my performance of course there are so many many factors yeah. of you um, coming up with a poor character or not being able to deliver a character properly mm. or accepting a role that is not befitting of your status and all of that. There's so many, many, many factors. Mm. Political uh, friends, you know, um, sentiments, yeah. so many things, you know. Yeah. If I if I put in professionalism into my uh, my career as an actor, yeah. trust me, all these years, I would, I would not, there won't be growth. Yeah. There will be no growth. My business in Nigeria is done like almost like brotherhood. It's like, ah, oh, you're my brother, you're my yeah, friend. True. You know, we need you to, it's you know, that that. So if we come with that platform of the typical um, uh, developed countries and how they do their stuff, mm. even in banking, even in politics, even mm -hmm. look everywhere. It's it's more like brother, you know, friends, you know, yeah. um, cousins, all of that. That's how we do business. Mm -hmm. Even if you want to strictly say, okay, fine, 
yes, we're doing business, but these are my principles. That's mm -hmm. fine. Rather than saying, oh, no, no, it's all professional. You must do this or you mm -hmm. must go through that. And like, eh. You were not noticing something be like this. And now you can't tell me I'm going to say, okay, no problem. Eh? Because, you know, <laughs> so you know that kind of stuff. Yeah. And we go through that most most times. That's mm -hmm. why it's... um. It's, it's, it's easier sometimes when you get involved, I'm um, sorry, it's not that easy when you get involved with something mm -hmm. and you realize that, ah, you, sh you shouldn't have done it, but man, yeah. you got caught up one way yeah. or the other. So when criticism's called and you could explain to them, you explain it. Okay. If you can't, mm -hmm. that's bad. Yeah. Okay. What are we looking forward to 2018 from you? Uh, well, I am uh, a couple of movies uh, in the offing. Right now, I worked with Moses Ewang. Yeah, uh, we I shot a movie. One. I saw uh, it on it's, Instagram. It's gonna, yeah, hopefully it's going to be coming out sometime. <laughs> you this seem year. very, de as in everybody is playing with stuff and you're like, oh, you have your script in front of you and you're like, I'm not messing around. I'm like, here to work. <laughs> yeah, so as in. <laughs> yeah, we had to break a couple of things down. Okay. I did that movie. It's a good story. It's something like looking for. We call it Crazy People. Okay. Uh, we're going to look, we're, we're going to title it before. We're going to title it Ramsey Who? You know, but <laughs> okay. it was almost like a guy, like a crazy guy who, who found himself thinking that he's Ramsey now. Okay. And then he went about telling everybody that he's Ramsey now. So it's like a, a sweet kind of story that has a good twist in the end. Okay. Yeah. And then I have, um, I'm working on a project right now with AY. It's like, ah, okay. like a big blockbuster that's coming out. <laughs> okay. So this is like a match made in heaven, right? I can't, I can't help but ask because 30 Days in Atlanta, Accidental yes, Spy. Yeah. yeah. This is the third. Is that like yeah. a match made? Like... Accidental Spy was. Um, or he was AY's just in it. Manager actually. Ah, okay. So. Yeah. Okay. So I have, um, I have this one, and then I have, uh, I have that coming out, and then I'm thinking about doing my TV series too. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Also, I'm, I'm trying. I'm working on something like an online. Um, you know, serious? like giving master classes, you know, for ah. my Instagram, live Instagram. Okay. Yeah, we're still trying to put that together. Okay. You know, just giving like a like quick master classes to mm. people, oh, like almost like, free. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Okay. I do it live with everybody who cares to come online. Okay. And do stuff that, like that. That's a good one. As yeah. in, I have tons of questions, that I'm, but <laughs> as in, time is not is not my um, friend today, and this is my like my first edition. But I promise, Ramsey will be here again. Yeah, as sure. in, I will go through that hurdle to get yes. him back into. <laughs> The studio so again. I say, I'll go to <laughs> yes, I will go. I will Mount climb that mountain to have <laughs> Ramsey back here. But as in, maybe for parting, um, just to end the show, if you have, is there anything from your previous roles that you would like to share with upcoming acts? Like just a quick one before we round off. Um, yes, I know mm -hmm. you. You were going to pitch in a question about uh, which was the most um, challenging that affected my personality more than. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yes, well, I was yes. going to do that one. <laughs> How, I think the uh, the one that got me a bit a bit um, uneasy was uh, yeah. my wife and I. <laughs> oh, you yeah, know, yeah, no, playing you the female role and all yeah. of that was kind of like uh, <laughs> made me so uneasy. I was um, on set, I and you know the director would. I would. I would be hoping that she wouldn't be able to catch it. And she'd be like, "No, no, no. Women don't do that. This is how women do." I'm like, oh no. It's, it's it's just really. I think it's easier for women to want to play the boy men, yeah. than for I men to so. want to play women. I, th I think it's so. It's the most difficult thing <laughs> for men to want to play women. Yeah. It's more, it's, more, it's tougher. Okay. Women find it easy to just get into yeah. the character of we playing a boy. Tomboyish. Yeah, they can be tomboyish. Yeah. But it's always hard the other way around. Yeah, okay. That's, that's really good to know. So yeah. here, for 2018, Explore Nollywood has been on 92.3 Inspiration FM with Ramsey Noah. <laughs> <laughs> So, Explore Nollywood is going to be fantastic this year. I have more people coming up. Awesome. Directors, producers, writers, costume guys, Perfect. music people, everybody across the Nigerian film industry to come and talk about the field, what it takes. I thank you, Ramsey, for coming thank through. You, I thank you me. for just honoring it as in some people have never met me and they come through thank you very much i appreciate for all of you that called i want to say thank you explore nollywood will be on your down next week saturday at 8 p.m have a fantastic rest of the weekend people ciao <laughs>